Patrick with Premier Guitar. We're at the Mayonis booth here, the Winter Nam Show in Anaheim. And that was Aaron from Intervals, which you might have seen in a recent rig rundown, yeah. wearing this same shirt. <laughs> Called right? out. <laughs> Called out. And we're here with Matt from Mayonis, and we're going to talk about a couple of your new guitars. So tell us first about the one that, uh, that Aaron has here. So this is a completely new model. We've been thinking about doing more of a traditional shape for quite some time. And this year we decided that to present this model, it's called Aquila. Uh -huh. We've got two different specifications that we'll talk about later, but this one is fairly straightforward. It's, it's got the roasted swampish body, uh, then we have a quilted maple top, uh, we've got the Goto hardware, Lolar pickups, yeah. one-piece wing and neck with ebony fingerboard, stainless steel frets, 12-inch uh, radius, locking tuners by Goto as well. It is fairly simple, but we wanted to cover Ashma's ground in terms of the tone of the guitar. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Aaron, let's have you, we heard the, the bridge pickup on the intro there, let's have you flip to one of the other positions and hear some more. the neck position. There we go. All right. So tell us what the pricing and availability will be on this one, man. Uh, so this one is available, available since this year. We have few that will be delivered to the dealers straight after the NAM. And then the next batch should be ready around April and we will continue the production. So it should be available by the end of the year within every single dealer. So and what did you say the price was? The price is around 3000 and, 3000 and a half. Okay. It depends on the specification. Got it. So, but, so yeah, so maybe we should go talk yeah. about the other one. Well, let's swap out to the other guitar. Yeah. yeah, let's go ahead. All right, Matt, so we swapped out guitars. Now we have another kind of variation on the shape. Yep. So kind of run down a little bit the differences between the one we saw and this one. So the main difference would be the material of the body. I mean, to be honest, everything is different between those two models. This one has a black limbo body. Okay. We've got a one piece roasted maple neck. Both guitars have a, a graphite reinforcements. So we've got on the top, we've got the 4A flamed maple top. Uh, same uh, hardware and same pickups, but we also have a, a roasted Berzai maple yeah. fingerboard with stainless steel frets, uh, also 12 inch radius, so it is different alteration of the same shape, but uh, we wanted to satisfy as much customers as we can, because at this point those two guitars only come with two fixed specifications, we will make a custom options available soon, but right now we would just want to present them as they are as the standard specs. So Aaron, this is probably one of the first times you've picked up these guitars at the show. I actually met the Aquila for the first time in the summer. I spent some time with the guys at the shop and we were specking some guitars for myself. Yep. And uh, truthfully, there was a prototype here a year ago that nobody knew about and I just let the cat out of the bag. But David uh, let me try one a year ago and then I played a few this summer and they're wonderful. I'm very familiar with this style of guitar and uh, it's, a, it's an incredible take. Um, it's a super high quality version of the vintage meets modern kind of vibe and um, between the spec on this one, the, the one I was playing previously and this, you get a lot of wide tonal variation. Limba is going to resemble more of a, a mahogany kind of vibe. Absolutely. Yeah. And then of course, you know, you have all of these contours and situations that resemble what they're doing with the Duvel way it kind of gives you a nice handshake. Very modern touch. Of course, usually you see a plate here, so they've done the bolt and some beveling and things to make it really nice. And of course, this one's going to be a little bit more balanced and a little darker with the Limba. The maple balances it out and then the other one's got that traditional ash vibe to it. So, All right, we're going to have you play us out here in just a second. Matt, tell us where people can go online to find out more about these models and everything else you guys are doing. Oh, definitely check our webpage. It's myness.com or go to the Facebook and Instagram. We post a lot of photos, a lot of info is right there. Obviously, we've got a very good dealers in the United States. All the list is on, uh, on our webpage. So there is uh, plenty of information that you can find online. All right. Thanks, fellas. Aaron, we're going to have you play us out. Thank you very much. This is Jason Shadrick with Premier Guitar. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for all of our NAM coverage. Thank <laughs> you.